Out of Northern Virginia, where police are searching for two men who opened fire into a crowded bar. Yeah, we're learning tonight that the suspects were angry. They couldn't bring their two young children with them into this business. Fox 5's Lindsay Watts is live in downtown Herndon tonight with new details. And Lindsay, what a crazy story this is. Yeah, that surveillance video, just shocking to watch. And this all happened around 10 o'clock on a Saturday night. Police say that two men got in an altercation with staff here at Sully's Poorhouse. But after that, surveillance video shows them running by right here, firing a shot into this glass door, barely missing an employee that was standing inside. It happens in a flash. The two men run by and boom, one of them fires off a shot. Inside the crowded bar, no one sees it coming. The glass shatters, leaving patrons stunned. Look at how close that bullet came to the man standing near the door. Police say it was a poorhouse employee. We're so lucky that nobody was hurt. Herndon police spokeswoman Lisa Herndon says this happened Saturday, November 6th, but police are just now releasing the surveillance images, hoping for help finding these men. There's also video of what happened before the shooting. Herndon says the men came to the bar after 10 o'clock with two young kids who you can see here. Judging by the video, maybe six years old for the oldest. Um, so they were told they couldn't come in. Um, it was after hours, so they couldn't come in with the small children. The video shows the men arguing with bar staff with the children nearby. The alleged gunman knocks over a stool and goes on to hit someone in the face. Bar staff tell me it was an employee. And when he stepped back from that, he uh, pulled a gun from his waistband. After he pulls the gun, a woman tries to stop him and others usher away the kids. Police say the men appeared to be meeting up with another group of people already at the bar. After the group leaves, police say it was only a minute or two before the men came back and opened fire. There's nothing I can expect that somebody going to shoot somebody. Food delivery driver Fareed Hamed was shocked when we showed him the video. He says he comes here to pick up food daily, describing it as a family-friendly neighborhood spot. Everybody's friendly and they are just come and enjoy their time and leave. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, what is happening here. We want to give you one last look at those suspects now. Witnesses tell police they got away in a gray Nissan. I did talk to a man who works here, who was here when all of this happened, and he talks about how shocking it was for everyone, especially with that close call with that bullet flying right into the building. Back to you.